Oh, hello there, my lovely. Take a seat and make yourself comfortable. My name's Dr. Sarah, and I believe you're here today for me to take a look at your ears and clean them out ahead of some surgery, yeah? Okay, so you have just some little growths just inside both ear canals that need removing. Yeah, they're completely benign. You have been told this, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Right. So, at the moment, have you got any ear pain at all? Right, okay. You just get a lot of pressure from the wax build-up. All right. Okay. Feeling generally well? Good. Good. Okay. So, I'm just going to grab some gloves and take a little look at you. All right? You don't have a latex allergy? All right. Okay. these on. That one's broken so we'll try another one. Sometimes they're a real pain these gloves. And when you've been wearing them for a while you just get so sweaty and horrible. <laughs> And I have to wear them a lot during the day, so in this hot weather it's not pleasant. But here we go, that's better. No broken ones there. Okay, so I'm going to have a little press around your outer ear. Alright, then I'll be looking down the ear before I proceed to clean. Okay, I need to take a little look just to see which method I'm going to use to clean out the ears. Alright? I'm going to give you a little wipe around first. Okay. Right. I'll do this left ear first. Just a gentle wipe around. Do your right here now. There we go, all done. So as I said, I'm just going to have a little palpate around the ear, a little bit of tugging on the ear, a little bit of tapping, and just feeling around for any lumps and bumps on the outer part of the ear for now, okay? Right. Do tell me if anything does feel particularly uncomfortable for you, my lovely. I can always stop. Okay, here we go.
everything looks and feels fine there. All right, let's take a look at your right ear now. Everything is also fine on that side, so we're off to a good start here. Okay, so next I'm going to pop an otoscope down your ear. Let's just turn that on. There we go. And it's got a light which I will just shine down the ear canal to see what's going on, to see how much wax is down there, and to see if there's any other signs of infection. And I can also have a little look at those those growths that are going to be removed. All right. Okay. Please keep your head very, very still, my lovely, all the way through when I do this. Pop up your hand if you want me to stop. That's not a problem. Okay. Perfect. Right. Here we go. Right. So I need to pull up and back on your ear very slightly. Just going to insert the endoscope now. There we go. So let's take a look. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of wax built up down here. It looks quite impacted as well. So I can't really see anything of your eardrum. But I can see the little growth there. It isn't anything to worry about, but we do like to remove them, if possible. Positioning just so I can make sure I've got every angle there. But that's that's okay. I can't see any signs of infection at the moment, so let me just take that out of there. of impacted wax on this side also. And a little growth there I can see. No obvious signs of infection or inflammation. My notes a second. Okay. Right. 
So there is a lot of impacted wax down both ears. So what I propose to do is to pop some special drops down your ears. Okay, those are going to break down that wax very, very quickly. You will hear some fizzy, crackly sounds as they do so. It's not painful. My patients love it. They say it's a very pleasant sensation. Okay, so I just need you to keep really still while I do it and then we'll get to work on breaking this wax down. Then I can start to remove it. Okay, you happy with that? Let me just get a couple of things ready there. Okay. Right. Just have to give these drops a good mix. They are stronger than what you can buy from a pharmacy. You can get some similar, but these are a special formula that we make here just for use in this practice. Okay. They're looking good. All right. Keep nice and still. Just going to pop a couple in each ear. All right, my lovely? Okay. You like the sound. Perfect. Okay, so that's getting to work in your left ear. Let's have a little look at this right. So you're fitting nicely. Perfect. Right then. So what I'm going to do first, my lovely, is I'm going to use this tool here just to have a scrape around to remove that wax as best I can, okay? Yeah, now. As I said before, please keep still, just pop up your hands if anything is uncomfortable, but I'll be as gentle as possible. Usually these drops are really good at softening the wax straight away, so it makes it very, very easy for me to just pull it out. Okay? All right. So let's go. Go in now with the tool, my lovely, and start picking up every bit.
got a lot out of there. So I'll take a look at this side, all right? There we go. Right, I'm just going to have another look down your ears before I decide whether I need to do some more picking or whether I can just go in with a brush and tidy things up. Okay, let's pop that on. Okay, I'll pop it in the left side first. It looks really good. I can see your eardrum. So it looks fine. There's no bulging, no wrinkling. It's not retracted. The structures behind are clear and look normal. The growth is visible and it will be easily accessible. Absolutely fine, Isabel, lovely. I'll just need to go in with the brush. see the air drum on this side too. Again, perfectly normal presentation. Ear canal looks fine, slightly red from the impaction but there's no infection there or no sign of any skin irritation particularly. There's no bleeding or oozing so that's good. Just needs a little brush out. You can see the little growth on this side as well, but again, that will be easily accessible when we get you back in for the removal of these. Okay. Right. So, for my next trick, I've got a very lovely little brush here, okay, and 
it will just gently remove any excess particles of wax and debris from the ear canal. Okay? Yeah. Okay, just keep still as usual for me, my lovely. Okay? It might sound a little bit loud in your ears, but it's not going to hurt you at all. Okay? All right. do anything else down there with the brush now. You like that? Good. We can't leave the right hand side out now, can we? So let's go in there with this and do the same. Do you feel okay? Not dizzy or anything? That's good. Okay. So I'm going to pop another couple of drops down. Actually, I'm just going to give your ears a little puff of air just to get rid of anything that may be on the outside before I put the drops down. Okay? Right, so... Here we go. You might like this. of soothing drops down because I've been working inside the ear. This just helps calm any irritation. It won't numb them up but it just soothes them. Okay, and there's one. Okay, 
mine just a little couple of pops around. How are your ears feeling now? Okay? Good. Just going to give them a little massage now with those drops being down there. There we go, my lovely. So you're all done, and we'll see you in about a week's time for the surgery, okay? Yeah, we'll soon get rid of those little growths for you, and you won't feel a thing, I promise. Yeah, but if you've got any questions or you're nervous, just give us a call and I can talk to you, okay? Any problems in the meantime, also give us a call, but I think you'll be fine, all right? Okay, so enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you very soon. Take care. Bye bye.